Okay, she's standing there. Uh, just gonna leave the link for this and we'll read up <clears throat> on this weekly page. There's a lot here. You, you a lot more you can look at too, as well. There. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh. Uh, he was a Honka Native American chief who success, successfully argued in U.S. District Court in 1879 in Omaha that Native Americans are persons with the are persons within the meaning of the law and have the right of habeas corpus. I mean, <laughs> uh, hang on a second, please. Okay. Uh, here's wife Suzette was also signatory in that famous court case. That's a long, long story here. Um, uh, but they, in order to get any kind of recognition or anything, they had to go to court. Uh, because they were getting uh, their trade routes and their lands, you know how they done the indigenous people, anyway, um, with their land, took them from their original land and put them somewhere else and shit, so, uh, but they had to go and say, we are persons within the meaning of the law, according to their laws, you know, the elite laws, uh, anyway, just wanted to do this real quick, if, if you know, want to look into him and stuff, you know, uh, a lot of legality. You are not a person unless we say so. Unless it's deemed by our laws. Come on. What the fuck? Anyway, take care, y'all. Uh, much love. See ya.